Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. Today's video is a Hot Flash Monday video and we are testing the Catrice HD Liquid Coverage Foundation. Lasts up to 24 hours, mattifying, second skin effect. And I already put it on this side of my face because I forgot to turn the camera on and I didn't realize it wasn't recording. So, I am going to go ahead and apply it to this side of my face for you guys because like I said, I didn't realize it wasn't recording. It's just one of those days. So, it's very liquidy. And so far what I've seen from putting it on the other side is it's not real high coverage. It's kind of a light coverage. So, after I do this side, and I am doing it with a brush because it's so thin, I'm thinking that a sponge would just suck it all up. So after I do this side, we will see if we can build it up a little bit on the other side. It seems really nice though. It's just not very high coverage. Actually, it's very light coverage. So if you don't need a high coverage foundation, you might love this. But I haven't haven't done enough yet to know so okay let's go back in and add some more and see if we can build it up at all <gasps> shoot there was a lot more in that dropper I guess I hadn't squeezed it before well we're gonna find out now if it builds up because we got a lot I hadn't spread this out a little and then I'll go back in and make sure it's all smooth. Well, it does seem buildable because it does seem like I have at least medium coverage now. But for those of you that's the same skin tone as me, did I say what color was sand beige? Yes, sand beige. It seems nice. I forgot to tell you guys that I already put on my, um, I used the Tarte Marine Boost underneath today and the Algenist Pore Correcting Primer, Pore Correcting Anti-Aging Primer. It still looks good. It looks great. So I am just going to use my, oh no, forgot concealer. I am going to use the Catrice um, Camouflage Concealer. Give this a try since it's Catrice, Catrice um, Foundation. It should go together well, right? They definitely should play together since they're the same brand. juice all right hopefully that's enough and I will be using this to prime my lid too Okay, now we're going to go in with our Laura Mercier. Um, I am just going to 
use the translucent today. Since this seems a lot lighter, I am just going to bake with it under my eyes. And I am not using the brightening powder, I'm just using the regular translucent powder. And I am just placing it under here and letting it brighten by baking with it. So I'm going to put it on pretty heavy. And then I'm going to put it on my nose, not as heavy, and on this huge wrinkle between my eyes, and a little down here, and a little over here. Pretty much just what's on my sponge is what I'm going to put over here. And then I'm going to let that sit for just a few minutes, and I'm going to actually do my brows while I'm letting that sit. So now we're gonna go in and we're gonna do our brows. I'm gonna start with the Cabrow in number three. And I'm just going to draw the underline and I'm just gonna do it lightly. And then I'm just going to fill them in. Brows just take forever. Cause it seems like it's, it always seems like it's going great. And then it doesn't. And then when you think you're almost done, it's like, well, that needs a little bit and this needs a little bit. And that's why I normally go off camera to do my brows because you just never know. And it takes so long and nobody wants to watch a long video. So, that's why I make a dedicated video to doing your brows. And then when I'm doing regular videos where I just do my whole face, I usually don't do them on camera because they take too long. That's all there is to it. They just take too long. I think my baking's had long enough. So then we just go like this. Dust off all that baking. Take a little more powder. Take it off. And set everything else. Okay, and that is it for the first stop on our Hot Flash Monday. Um, so far, I really like this foundation. It looks really nice and smooth and pretty flawless. It's still not full coverage, but it's close. It's at least medium coverage. It's not sinking into line, my lines. We shall see. I'm going to go off camera and I'll be back. Okay guys, I am back and this is the um, check-in, not the final check-in, but the second check-in after I've done my, the rest of my makeup with this Catrice HD Liquid Foundation and we're also using the Catrice Camouflage Concealer and we're trying both of them out on, for our Hot Flash Monday video. Um, 
I'm not sure about this foundation. It, it looks pretty nice, but it also looks like it's oxidizing. I feel like I look a little bit orange. Maybe that's just up close. Cause, and when I look in the mirror way back here, it looks fine. And when I look in the viewfinder, it looks fine. But when I look in the mirror over here, actually when I look at the mirror over here far away, it's fine. When I get in close, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just crazy. Anyways, this is our first check-in and so we will check in. But it looks really good and smooth, so it's looking good so far. I will check in at the end of the day and let you know my final thoughts on it. But so far it looks good. It's got medium coverage. And it is a matte finish, so, but it is a drugstore brand, and so far, so good. I will check back in at the end of the day and let you know how it did. I haven't had any hot flashes yet, so I'm sure I will. I'll let you know. I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. It's the end of the day. We are going to wrap this up. This is our Hot Flash Monday review of the Catrice. HD Liquid Coverage Foundation and the Le Catrice Camouflage Concealer. I think they both held up great and I had numerous hot flashes. It is not as high coverage, I don't think, as the um, last one I did, the CYO. That's a drugstore one too. But this one, if you don't want super high coverage, this one is good. This one has like two layers and it's, it's a good medium coverage and it dries down matte it doesn't transfer it doesn't sink into lines nope still no sinking into lines and that's amazing when you have hot flashes that it doesn't start to sink in so anyways that's it for our video today i'm giving this one a thumbs up for hot flash monday if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe before you leave follow me on snapchat twitter facebook and instagram don't forget to leave comments below of other things you'd like to see me try, especially things for our Hot Flash Mondays. And I love you guys. I appreciate you. And I will see you in my next video. Mwah.